No, every day we live in life, bro. Up and down, going through, going through changes and, you know what I'm saying? Real life, you know? Hospital, might need another level. Uh, Juan Hillman, we're out here in uh, San Diego, out in Carlsbad. Uh, get my work in out here to uh, activate. Out here with my guy TJ Moreno. But um, it's a day in the life. Let's come through right now. forward to most coming back into the game? Uh, I miss competing, so uh, just ready to get out there and compete. I miss being around uh, the guys in the locker room. Uh, you know, having that bond with teammates and uh, when you go through tough times during the season, you have that teammate you can rely on and uh, ask, ask questions and uh, get some information. But uh, I'm really just eager to get out there and uh, leave my mark on the game. Um, people may have forgot about things I can do. I mean, I'm out of season, which I don't, I mean, which, which is expected. But uh, I'm ready to go out there and compete and, and have fun again. Hey, how you like Cali so far? I ain't gonna lie. Cali pretty, it's pretty, it's pretty cool. Uh, laid back vibes. Kind of remind me of Florida, but just a little more. A little more laid back in Florida. You in, you in SoCal. You got to come to the Bay one time and tell me it's like Florida. Come on. Invite <laughs> me out. I'm ah, yes. Not the clothes and tripping. Why hit the top to go out to the bottom? All these people falling for me like an autumn. I'm trying to tell you, homie, you don't want none. They free me, so I'm right back to that money, huh? Somebody tell you. Cool on the run. When they let him out of prison, I'd be 31. I knew I was a star when I was selling hard. Everybody told me. How far along in the rehab process are you? Uh, nine months going on 10 right now. What's it been like so far? Uh, I can definitely say it's a journey. Uh, it's definitely mentally challenging, but uh, I feel like I'm here for a reason. And uh, I feel like I'm, I'm fairly uh, mentally tough and uh, mentally strong. So. It's like another uh, bump in the road for me. I just got to overcome it, and uh, I'm here for a reason. So, you talk about those mental battles. What? Give an example of what you've been doing, or how you, what you've done specifically to handle them. Uh, just kind of do a lot of meditating. You have to. You have to sit in, uh, talk to yourself, and be real about your, uh, be real to yourself, and uh, look yourself in the mirror, and you feel like you're putting in the work, and then it'll definitely show. And uh, having those negative talks with yourself constantly, am I doing enough? Uh, could I be doing more? Or you're going out asking more questions and probably questions that you already know the answers to. It's just, it's just honestly just going back and forth with your, uh, with your mental, but the good and the bad, so. I knew I 
knew I was a star when I was selling hard Everybody told me I'd make it when I was on the block Sleeping full of rap, I was jacking cars I couldn't get all my time cause I was doing fraud Me and my little Marcus tearing up the wire It hurt me to my heart, I heard it getting 25 What advice would you give those who or may have just had Tommy John or some some type of injury in baseball or just any sport in general? Um, I would say keep going. Uh, trust the process. You definitely got to trust the process. But uh, keep going and follow protocol. Uh, you might feel like you're missing out on, on anything, the game uh, or whatever sport you're playing or whatever they, whatever you're doing, but you're not. Just uh, trust the process and uh, get back to 100%. That's all you can do. And trust God, and you'll be all right. Put in that work. Hey, thanks for tuning in. Uh, you know, it's been a pleasure speaking to you guys, showing you guys my day in, day out routine, and uh, just letting you guys know what's going on between this uh, long journey of Tommy John. So uh, just stay tuned and be on the lookout.